couple from Bermuda is now proud parents of twins, and they have quite the story to tell about their birth. The expectant mother traveled to Canada from Bermuda specifically because of the medical care available here, and despite the preparations, her twins were born three months early and eight days apart. Here's Global's Ben McDonald. Idana Bean gave birth to the first of her twin boys three months premature. Her second son was delivered a full eight days later. To have two live births and thriving as they are, just shocking doctors, shocking nurses, I, it's rare. Idana and her husband Ryan were airlifted to Halifax from Bermuda after Idana experienced a rupture in her first son's amniotic sac. The outcome didn't look good for little Amir Bean, but his parents kept faith. The emergency department in Bermuda, they were like, let's focus on twin B because twin A is not going to survive. And I was saying to myself, you know, how can they say that when he's still breathing, his heart's still going? And, but I said to him, you know, as long as you're fighting, so am I. The birth of their second son, Esai, was equally spectacular. Dr. Michael Vandenhoff has been with the Beans throughout the process. He says the extra time Esai spent in the womb was crucial for his survival. When you're at 26 or 27 weeks, every single day uh, counts. And, and so that extra period of time, a week, eight days, that actually was extremely beneficial for that baby. Incredibly, he may have actually saved his brother's life. Uh, my uh, twin B, Esai, he actually kept my uterus up enough to allow Emir to still live for as long as he did. He lasted eight weeks without amniotic fluid. The process has produced tears of joy for Bean. I'm sorry. She says she will never forget the battle she fought for the life of her children. So when Dr. Simbermuda said no, God said yes, and when I um, sit back and I think about my sons, I'm just so grateful. Amir and Isai Bean are both in good health. Ben McDonald, Global News, Halifax.